Hi, let's see how to fix the if I am not connecting to the service. If I am a popular modification framework for the Grand Theft Auto V, offers players the chance to enjoy the custom multiplayer experiences on the dedicated servers. However, it's not uncommon for the users to encounter the issues where FIAM fails to connect to the servers. So why FIAM not connecting to the servers? There could be few reasons like why FIAM is not connecting to the servers. First try to clear out the cache folder that often fixes the problem. Next, check if the firewall is blocking the FIAM server connection which can happen. Additionally, a network filters might get into the way so make sure to watch out for that lastly if your internet connection is unstable it might be causing the issue so let's see how to fix the fim not connecting to the servers the first method is check your internet connection suppose if you are having a poor internet connection with very low bandwidth this can cause a problem so always try to have the very good internet connection with very good speed and very good bandwidth try to reset your router or the modem you can switch off for a few minutes and then you can turn it back on so that will resolve any kind of bugs or the glitches present in your system or the application the second method is try a different servers if you can't connect to one server try connecting to any another to check if the problem persists to try different server on the fim now you can follow these steps open fim and go to the server browser browse through the list of available servers and select one that you want to join Click on the server to see the more information about it such as number of players and the server rules. If you want to join to the server, click on the join button, wait for the game to load and then connect it to the server. Third method is check the network filter. If you are using the network filter like one of the content or the applications, it's good to uh, add an idea of HTTPS CFX.org to the exception list. This way FIM can connect to the server smoothly without being blocked by the filter. Okay, so in order to add this exception to the list, you can follow some of the steps, open the network filter settings, look for the option to add exception or the whitelist, add this to the exception list or the whitelist, save the changes and the exit the settings. Fourth method is check for the updates. It's always important to ensure that the game is fully updated to the latest version. If you are using the older or the outdated version, always try to use the latest or the updated version. In order to do that, you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. And the fifth method is disable the firewall or the antivirus. Try temporarily disabling the firewall or the antivirus and check if there is a security applications are causing any connectivity issues. To temporarily disable your antivirus software, you can locate the antivirus program on your computer, open its settings and disable it. To temporarily disable the firewall, you can follow uh, these steps by going to the control panel, search for the Windows Defender firewall. Select the appropriate network profile, choose the option to turn off the firewall for the selected profile. Save the changes and exit the settings. Sixth method is clear the FIM caches. Always try to clear the FIM caches as sometimes these caches can get corrupted and can cause the issues with the applications. To clear the FIM caches on your device, you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. Seventh method is uninstall and reinstall the application. If the earlier fixes didn't work for you, Think about uninstalling the FIM from your device and then download it and again again you can install it from the official website. In order to do that, follow these steps sequentially one by one. The eighth method is contact the FIM support team. If the previous fixes didn't work for you, you can contact the FIM support team for more help. They are the experts, they can give you the specific guidance to solve the issue. Okay. So that's all about this. Thank you.